Oh gosh. Well, welcome back to, you guess what, the quarry. Today's video, we're going to return to where we left off from where we left off from. Um, don't forget to be subscribed, hit the like button, hit the notification bell, you never miss any content of the quarry. And the Minecraft content will be back soon, guys. Don't worry about that. And yes, uh, he, like the werewolf inside him was going to take off his body, but Abby pushed him in the water. Now he's like, like very cold, so he's inside the hut and uh, next to the fire to keep warm. And now Abby is trying to find something. And yes, if you want this video to be 200 likes, if that's possible, let's do that and see what happens. So yeah, that's really. Oh gosh! Alright, let's pretend where we left off. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Just try to rest. Hey. Alright, let's look for something to keep him warm. Okay, I wish this will be a more... Oh, this is just a shower thing. Nice, nice. Um, let me keep going this way. Yeah, nothing around here. What is... Um... Poor Nick. In there. In here? Let's check this locker. The hell? This place was so different like 12 hours ago. <laughs> Bit odd. Yo. Oh. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Dude is real sick. Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like a... He was like a fish out of water. Right. Uh, oh my god. Sure. <laughs> you know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds, too, at the lodge. What do you mean? Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit, or scratched, or whatever. He just kept moving around, like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt. Huh. Mm -hmm. Rabies? He's not frothing in the mouth. <sighs> I think Abby would beg to differ. Point. It isn't aquaphobia a symptom of rabies? Hydrophobia, yeah. But I think it's more about a fear of drinking, not just getting wet. This was like... Like my cat in the bathtub. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Of course. Do you like me? Um, I don't know what's going on with you. I haven't really enjoyed spending. I have really enjoyed spending time with you. Nick. Please, just tell me. I've really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. Such a. Oh, such a. Such what? Such a cop out answer. What? Abby? Uh, what? I've got something to ask you. Uh, what? Yeah. 
okay. Why didn't you like me, Abby? Oh no. Nick, I do like you. No, no you don't. You don't like me at all, do you? What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. God. Smart, are you? Poor stupid Abby. Stop. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. This isn't you. This this isn't you. I... What? <laughs> Jesus. Hey, Abby. Abby, everything okay? Holy shit. Oh, shoot. I can't do this. I'm not shooting. My God. This is really bad. This is bad. This is really bad. Hey, let's not, um... You know... Let, what are we gonna do? We're fucked. We're, we're really fucked. Oh, shit. Where the fuck is Chris Hackett? Oh, uh, who is it? Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? My name is Laura Kearney. So? Go let me in. It's not safe out here. Uh, yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you... Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yeah? You were supposed to be working, uh... Helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? You and the guy, what's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should. I think that we should listen to her inside. We're going to open the door. Okay. I'm gonna open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Okay. Abby! Here we are again. Just... You? Oh. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? I found nothing. Did you look hard enough? Yes. This <sighs> car 
words aren't just trinkets. You should know this by now. They they can help you. I can help you. I can't believe that. Off you go then. Top top. One down, remember. Isn't that terribly exciting? So we got Dinan, Ryan, and We did come. One night early. That was our mistake. Yeah, it was your mistake. Because our friends are dead. Great. Great. Oh my gosh, Abby. Wait, what? Oh, it's not Abby. Rampant. Not calling it out. What is that cop doing? No! This is an interrogation. I ask, you answer. Oh, wait. Yes. Comply. Laura Kearney. Who are you traveling with? And what is your relationship? Max Brindley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Just... Fine. Fine. What do you want to know? Oh. Well. Uh. Why are we going to Hackett's Quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and we're broke. Mm -hmm. And? Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. Wait, hack it? Like, Chris hack it? Don't change the subject. What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime, go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Do you understand? 
no, because I do not care. Please stop trying to. Please. Will you just stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on? Is, is Max alive? I feel like I'm going crazy. Please, what is going on? Max! Hey! Hey! You! Asshole! You wanna tell us what the fuck's going on? Max! I know you hear me! Fuck! Max! Are you okay? Yeah. I mean, I'm... I'm kind of all mixed up, but... More or less intact, I think. Laura? Yeah? Why am I naked? What? I mean, after we got attacked... The next thing I know, I'm waking up in a jail cell and you're gone. And now you're back again, and, and, and I'm super naked, and there's blood and stuff everywhere. I mean, what the fuck happened? I was hoping you might know. He... Yeah, so our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk? The pincher? The blade? Three-hole punch? No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max! What? Did you even look at the map? Hackett's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. And it gets better. I got to look at his name badge and Oh great. Ah, close. Thank you. Get dressed. What's he giving you? I'm not going to be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey. Did I say you could talk to each other? Mission. Sorry, sir. We'll be quiet. We will? Max? Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? Shit. All right, buddy. Hands through the bars. Come on. Your turn. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. We can talk right here. Come on. Hey. Hey. Let's Get go. the fuck off. Come on. Move. Good boy. Hey. Stop struggling. Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Laura. What the hell did you do to her? Shut up. Okay. Okay. We need to figure out. Okay. Think, Laura. Think. 
gotta be something in here you can use. Alright. Let's carry on. Uh, what's that? While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Nice. Nice to know. Very nice to know. Sis. Oh. Not a chance. I need some sort of lever. On the bed, I'm guessing. Try the bed. You sure? It will cut yourself, I I but hey, where it go? Now, watch it, man. I bruise easily. Give me a break. No, I hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Can you get out? The fuck is that supposed to mean? Hey! What the fuck is that supposed to mean, asshole? Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! We need to think of a plan to get out. Fuck! Max, why you would do that? It's metal bars, you know? How did we go? How to go in there? You sing like a canary? Nothing to sing about. I'm sure you've got plenty to confess. <laughs> well, that may be true, but I don't think he's too interested in how I cheated off Mikey Washington in eighth grade chem. <laughs> really, though? What happened? What happened? He, uh... He just asked a lot of questions. About what? A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Wow. Why, he didn't ask you? No. Huh. Rude. We need to think of a plan to escape. Oh, hey, did you get a look at his name badge? You mean it's not really Detective Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Sheriff Hackett. You think he's related to Chris Hackett? Oh my god, like THE Chris Hackett? Yeah. Who's THE Chris Hackett? As in camp leader Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry, remember? Wait. Man. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. 
The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring. That's... That's... I mean... What? Some kind of a setup. He's not actually like it. Like some kind of setup, a, a, a trap. I don't know. Chris Hackett and Sheriff Hackett. There's no way that's a coincidence. Okay. They must be related. Well, what does that prove? They knew we were coming. Maybe it's some kind of kidnapping, extortion, conspiracy. That's a pretty big job. I'm not- I'm just trying to get us out of here, and I can't get us out of here until I have some clue of why the fuck we're in here. Good- Good point. Very good know, point. We can't make sense of it. This isn't forever, Max. You, you can't just hold us here forever. You didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that! Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna let this fleabag fuckface stop me. Come on, Max. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're... gonna... Um... What? I'm gonna what? I saw the letter, Max. What are you talking about? The rejection letter for college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff? I can't believe you didn't tell me. I... I was embarrassed. Wait, you're... No. I'm sorry, Max. I this really sucks. Hey, it's not the worst thing to happen this summer. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know, you can talk to me about anything, right? Yeah. Yeah, I do. Oh, man. Oh, man. Okay, let's just... Focus on getting out of here, for now. Great. Sign me up. We need to go over it from the beginning. Like from when we left home? Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually... Yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. Do you think it was a good idea to have lied to him? About hitting a pothole? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. I think he probably knew we were lying. He was acting really strange. What if he's not even a real cop? I told you! Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... Nobody around. Nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack and hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead, there's this nobody happens. there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. That part's all fuzzy for me. Like, I, I remember the steps, and a smell like wet fur, and a, a dog collar with the name Ian on it. Ian? Ian. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was, was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. Nice to know. What's messed up about that is... Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. Wait, what? What? Hey, okay, so weird question. Do you remember... Before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, Whoa, look at the moon. It's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, Yeah, no shit, Max, it happens once a month. Yeah, so? 
Right, so, you know, full moon. Yeah? What if, uh... Okay, no, stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe there's a slight chance it was a werewolf. Are you- Damn mine? <laughs> Seriously? What the fuck? What? 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 What's so funny? I said literally the exact same thing. So, Wes Max. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies, aliens, time hopping Draculas? Uh, Ryan. Ryan, right? Yeah. You want answers? I've got answers. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. Whatever. Would it really be so crazy? I can't believe all the about shit Albie. that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. I can't believe this. Okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body. You told me to. And if it's bite with which you're faced, cleave limb from torso with great haste. What? You did the right thing. See? She got a whole poem about it. Oh my god. There's more to all this than you think. Just let me finish, and you can decide for yourself. I'm doing it high. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. Oh my god. The cop kept us fed and let us take showers, but aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. As much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again. And nothing was making sense. All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. How? I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. They're probably in the same crap at camp. No, I can't take being in here anymore. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so, you know, let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Max. <laughs> you are forgetting something. What? Just the ETBT tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into the sunset only to be stopped when. I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth? Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. Alright, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. We got to escape. What if we get his good side? Oh, uh, let's try this. I'm not gonna be nice to this fucker one second longer than I have to. We've got to escape. Cool, okay. So how? I don't know. Knock him out? Not... Laura, you know that's kind of a movie thing only, right? I mean, you bang someone on the head, you're more likely to kill them or leave them with permanent brain damage, not just knock him out. Well, what can you do? Yeah. At least try. Okay, fine. So we don't knock his brains out. I guess that means send friend request. 
No? I wasn't saying that we shouldn't break his head open. Just that we might be doing a whole lot more than knocking him out. Well... Let's just try the non-violent way first. Yeah, let's do that. <laughs> so, alright, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. And he's gotta have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to leave it here. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the, in the comments, and I'll see you guys in...